So here I wanted to take a look at some of these branches off of the celiac. And we've come real close here. And um, you can see that we're near the, the kidney here. And we have these very first arteries that branch off of the descending aorta coming through the diaphragm here. And so we've got this one branching up, and that is the celiac, and this is superior mesenteric, and the superior mesenteric is going to the large colon here, um, the descending colon, I should say, of the large intestine. But let's get close again. So um, this is taking a look at the celiac, and then we notice this branching off. The celiac is called the celiac until here. That's when this branch is off. And it's going behind the stomach. That is hepatic artery. And you could take a look at that other movie that I took today um, that uh, was the dissection movie. And I do confirm that this, although it, it looks like it's going to the stomach here, it goes behind the stomach. We can do a little bit of it here. Um, you can see here that I'm where, where I'm poking through here with my um, tweezers here. Um, that's right here where that um, hepatic artery is. And so it, it does indeed go to the liver, as you would expect a hepatic thing to do. And then um, once that hepatic artery branches off, then you have this that's the, the continuing towards the spleen, and that is called splenic. And here I'm, I'm spreading, uh, I'm gonna bring the cat down a little bit. Uh, I'm spreading the, the spleen a little bit here. This is the anterior portion of it. This is the posterior portion of it. It usually would be down here, but then we can't see anything. So um, I, I push it up here. And we can see that splenic again here. So splenic branching into anterior splenic, posterior splenic. Posterior splenic is, is the larger one. And I can just kind of push things down again. Again, that's still splenic. We can kind of pick it up in comparison to our hepatic artery back there. OK, here's taking a look at the hepatic portal. and. Remember with the way that the spleen is. So here's the spleen, and this is that tip end of the spleen that normally would be facing towards the tail. But I have it lifted up, I have it pinned up. And so that just means that in terms of some of our directions of things, it might appear reversed. But just remember that this is that position. So. Um, this is the posterior end of the spleen. This is the anterior end of the spleen. So just taking a look at the yellow vessels here, this is, and by the way, this is Katniss Everdeen, the, the one that I just took a look at for the reproductive dissection, but she ended up having a brightly colored hepatic portal, so I thought that was nice. So. Um, this long yellow vessel here that goes to this tip end of the spleen is the posterior splenic vein, and this is the anterior splenic vein. I'll get a little closer. And then they come together here to form the gastrosplenic vein. So posterior, anterior, gastrosplenic. And then the gastrosplenic is coming right in here. And then we see this big vessel here. It's uh, it got a little bit of purple over it here. But above where the gastrosplenic comes in, that's where there's hepatic portal. And then the part that's below that is superior mesenteric. And the superior mesenteric picks up blood from the small intestines. And then we see this vein here. And that's going to the transverse colon. I'll just kind of spread it out here. And so this large uh, yellow vessel that goes to 
the transverse colon is the inferior mesenteric. So we've got inferior mesenteric here, superior mesenteric here. It's actually still called superior mesenteric once the inferior still branches off. So inferior, superior. We have a lot of intestinal arteries and veins here. I'm just lifting up the small intestines. We see a lot of those. I'll push them back again. Now, um, another um, nice look at this dissection is to look at those pancreatic duodenal arteries and veins. And um, this, this one had a, a particularly nice posterior pancreatic duodenal artery and vein. You can see them both here. You can notice that they're coming into the pancreas that's next to the duodenum. So they are well-named blood vessels, although they are, they do have long names. And then can you see this nice yellow arching there? So that's the anterior pancreatic duodenal. And I kind of pick at it a bit and you can see that red in there as well. And so those are both anterior pancreatic duodenal. They are right here branching off of hepatic portal because this is hepatic portal and then this is gastrosplenic coming in there.